hyphen faster dc.k from 360 leader. It's time to talk about the best tips and tricks to fix FaceTime video meshes not working on iPhone and iPad. One of the most loved FaceTime features is the ability to record a video message. For times when you wish to communicate with your loved ones but they are unable to pick up your call, the video message comes into play. Unfortunately, many users have reported that they can't send a FaceTime video message. If you have also faced this very problem, I have got your covered with some pretty handy solutions. That's it, let's get started. First and foremost, I would like to point out that FaceTime video message requires both the devices to have iOS 17 or iPadOS 17 or later installed. Hence, make sure to check out this must-have requirement with RFL. Another important requirement that you need to take care of beforehand is the fact that the record button appears only when someone doesn't pick up your call. So, if you're wondering why the record button doesn't show up, Keep this essential thing in mind. After that, I will recommend you to have reset your iPhone or iPad. If the record button still doesn't appear, go for the hard reset as it has got the knack for fixing common issues or the weird ones. To do so, press and release the volume up button, then press and release the volume down button, then you have to hold down the power button until you see the Apple logo on the screen. Then open the FaceTime app and make a video call to your friend. If your friend doesn't pick up your call, you will see the record button. Tap on this button to record the video and send it. Next up, I will recommend you to disable enable FaceTime on your iPhone or iPad. Many a time, all you can do to fix the FaceTime with your message not working issue is to just enable disable the FaceTime app. So, we will give this tip a chance as well. To get it done, open the settings app on your iPhone or iPad. Now scroll down and tap on FaceTime. Then turn off the toggle next to FaceTime. After that, restart your device. And once your device has rebooted, go back to the FaceTime setting and then enable it. Next up, I would suggest you to check out if the FaceTime app is down or faced with any technical issue. To do so, open a browser on your iPhone or iPad. Then head over to the Apple System Status web page. Next, make sure that the FaceTime app is up and running as usual. Just in case the app is faced with any technical issue, you can't do anything but wait until Apple fixes the problem. And finally, I will recommend you to update the software as there is a high chance that a software bug could be behind this issue. To do so, open the settings app on your iPhone or iPad. Then tap on general. Then tap on software update. And finally download and install the latest iteration of iOS or iPadOS as usual. And that's all there is to it. So these are the best tips and tricks to fix FaceTime video messages not working on iPhone and iPad. Hopefully you have gotten a better at the problem. If you found this video helpful, do like and share it. And I'll see you in the next video with more such handy tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye.